Morning, three current and former St. Louis aldermen face seven charges related to a pay to play scheme. Board of Aldermen President Lewis Reed, committee chair Jer Jeffrey Boyd and former alderman John Collins Muhammad were indicted on federal theft and bribery charges. This is corruption reaching the highest levels of City Hall. And this morning we are digging into that 66 page indictment. Our Ryan Henson is joining us live from City Hall to break down these explosive claims. And also, where do we go from here, Ryan? Well, this play pay to play scheme revolves around th those three politicians allegedly accepting cash bribes and other items in exchange for tax breaks for small business here in town. Now, the indictment is lengthy, 66 pages, and there's a lot of information in there. And there's excerpts from recordings with a person who was listed as John Doe, his name Muhammad Altmotan, and he was a government informant. And it says the alderman of the 22nd Ward, Jeffrey Boyd, accepted more than $9,500 in cash and car repairs for a huge discount on a city-owned plot of land. Former alderman John Collins Muhammad accused of accepting $10,000 in cash, a phone, and a free car in exchange for property tax breaks worth up to $300,000. The indictment also says the second most powerful politician in the city, Board of Aldermen President Lewis Reed, accepted more than 18,000 in cash and campaign contributions while he tried to steer city contracts and shepherding tax breaks through city, si th through city hall. Five on your side, caught up with Alderman Reed uh, as he left the federal courthouse yesterday. President, you plan to resign your post? Uh, no. Why not? Uh, I'm not resigning. Won't it hurt the public right, trust to stay in this post while you're under federal indictment? No, an, an indictment isn't doesn't mean that you're guilty. So the judge forbids Reed and Boyd from having any communication unless it's about city business on the record and in public. There's a meeting on Zoom uh, coming up at 10 o'clock that's going to have all the aldermen and city leaders there. We're going to be there. We're going to tune in and we're going to bring continuing to bring you coverage on this continuing story here in St. Louis. I'm Ryan Henson, five on your side. All right. Thank you, Ryan. And as Ryan said, you can follow the story and be updated on KZK.com following the meeting today at 10 o'clock. You can also get breaking news alerts and updates by downloading the free five on your side app.